time for an Accutane update. I have been on Accutane for almost four months now, so I thought I would come on and do a little chit chatty video about Accutane and everything that's been going on with my face. As you can see, I currently have no makeup on, so this is what my acne looks like four months on Accutane. If you've never been here before, my name is Zoe. I do social media for a living. I live in New York City, and I post here on YouTube about beauty, fashion, fitness, lifestyle, and obviously Accutane. So if you're interested in any of those things, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. I'm also working on a thousand subscriber giveaway. So once we hit a thousand subscribers, I'm doing a big beauty and wellness giveaway. So make sure you subscribe so you can check that out when that happens but for now let's go ahead and talk Accutane. So I'm currently taking 80 milligrams of Accutane a day. Each one of these is 40 and then you can see here I take two of these pills a day, one in the morning, one at the night time. I started with 40 once a day then I moved up to 60 and I was on 60 now I have reached 80 and because I went up a little bit, my face started peeling a lot and is really, really dry now. I feel like they talk about Accutane like drying out your skin, you're gonna have dry skin. No, like you're gonna have dry skin. I have never felt this in my life, like anything like this. My lips, you could probably see, are all busted. They're always like cut open. Um, so that's just one of the things that I personally am dealing with. After being on Accutane for four months, I have not felt any of the other side effects. So I did have slight joint pain at the very, very beginning, but that could have been in my head and then it went away. I also got two nosebleeds the first month that I did it, but it was also during the winter. So it could have been from that and I haven't gotten a nosebleed or anything like that since. So the main side effect that I'm dealing with is really just the dry skin. I don't know, I mean, this is probably kind of gross. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I had something happen to my, my ear and like my earring and it's so, so dry and got all dried out. So I took out my earring, but I don't know. Again, like I could have some sort of weird ear thing or it could be the Accutane, like everything is up for debate. Also my hands at one point, now they're a lot better, but they were really, really crusty. You could probably see like I have cuts all over. It's really easy to get cut or to like have anything happen to you because um, your skin is so, so dry. At this point, I can't really say if it was like worth it or not because my skin is still breaking out like crazy. I have a few new ones that are like coming up here, but for the most part, I'm like not breaking out a ton. I'll pop up a video, a video, a picture of what I looked like before starting Accutane, just so you guys can kind of um, see the difference a little bit. But I think it is better than when I started. Like the first month I was breaking out insane, like so, so bad. Now I'm less breaking out and more just super, super dry. So that's kind of where I'm at as far as my Accutane, almost four months in. I do think I will be on it for at least two more months, um, probably six to nine months is what she said, but she was saying that hopefully, and by she, I mean my dermatologist, was saying that hopefully by next month, um, I might be clear, have clearer skin. But yeah, I don't know if you guys can tell, even talking like hurts my lips a little bit if you're not applying chapstick immediately. like. They're so, so, so dry. Even like eating like a hamburger or something big, like I can't even open my mouth because it is just so incredibly dry. Other than that, I don't know. This is just like a quick chit chatty video. I hope this is helpful if you're thinking about going on Accutane or if you are on Accutane and you're like, what do I expect? Um, if you have any questions, definitely comment them down below. I've been answering questions. I also have a full playlist on acne and Accutane that I will link in the description if you're interested in checking out more of my videos. I have a skincare routine that I have been doing as well as just like why I started Accutane and some of the reasonings behind that. But yeah, this is pretty much what we're dealing with right now. I can bring you guys in, show you the works. Um, slow zoom. So again, I had a really big breakout here. Now it is kind of gone, but there's a scar. My lips all cracked, like look at that. Here, all cracked. Breaking out a lot on my cheeks and like around my hairline area. It's so crazy because, let me zoom you guys back out for this part. Um, it's really crazy because I'm getting acne in places where I didn't used to get acne. So I used to really only get acne like on my chin 
and then sometimes around my hairline and now I'm getting it like mainly on my cheeks weirdly on my nose like all these places where I used to never get it before because everything is just like coming to the surface. I'm hoping and praying that this is like the end all be all for me. I'm very scared about having to do another round. So occasionally if you do a full round of Accutane and it doesn't help, you do another round. Also, if you're 21, you can't drink. So I haven't really drank anything in about four months. I think there was like one night where I had one drink. It won't kill you, but you're not supposed to drink. Don't tell my dermatologist. Uh, but yeah, you're not supposed to drink. So that's been uh, a lifestyle change. Luckily, we're in the middle of COVID. So like, where am I really going to go anyway? But I think that's about it for this check-in. I'm definitely going to keep you guys posted as far as like complete before and afters. I've been filming like videos of my face like every single month. So you could see what it's like. Hopefully in a few months, we'll have a full update about all the things Accutane and I can just let you guys in on the journey and everything that's been happening with my skin. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for all of your support. And again, drop a comment if you have any questions. You could also DM me on Instagram if you don't want to like ask me in public. Um, I'll respond to you there. And I love you guys so much. I will see you in the next video. Bye.